Not yet. Wait. Just relax. Just, just easy. Me. Catch your breath. That's it. Relax. Calm down. Here we are. Sit down. That's it. That's it. Now, catch your breath. What is it? It's been accepted. My exophilus, you know, cardium grahammy. They've accepted it. Try to speak calmly, dear. What is it they have accepted? It's a tropical tree fern, and I discovered it during our honeymoon. And when I couldn't classify it, I thought it might be a true species. But I couldn't believe it. So I sent it to Wagner at the University of Michigan. And Henry, it is. It's a true species. I've discovered a true species. Well, it's very nice. Very nice. Well, well. Now you'll be able to name a whole species, won't you? Just like, um, what's his name? Louis A. de Bougainville. That's right. Or James Parkinson. Or um, Brussels, Brussels sprouts. sprouts. Well, well, well. You've achieved a kind of immortality after all, haven't you? Now you'll be in all the atlases under L right before Morgan, Muller, and Mendel. It will be cross-indexed under G. Alsophila Grahammy for Graham. For Graham? You mean that you've discovered a new species and have named it for Graham after doing all your work as Lowell? You fool, that's not the way to name a species. Can't you do anything right? I didn't name it for me, Henry. I named it for you. Alsophila Grahammy for Henry Graham. Alsophila Grahammy for Henry Graham. Well, I... Are you sure that they'll know? I mean, that it's me. Uh, will they have my name in the atlas under under G for Henry Graham? Yes, and, and they'll have you in all the textbooks, Henry, as a footnote. As a footnote, and in the atlases under G? Yes. Well, I've achieved a small slice of immortality myself, haven't I? As a footnote and under G. Are you pleased, Henry? Oh, yes, it was very thoughtful of you, Henry, yet I believe I am pleased. I. I put the tip of one frond into a plastic token so that you could wear it always if you want to. Oh, yes. Well, why not? I mean, it will be a wonderful conversation piece. What frond is in your token, Henry? Why my own frond? Nelsophila Grahammy. Why do you ask? Do you like it? Yes, yes. It's very attractive in the good lines. I mean, for a frond. Don't you, don't you think it should be under... Under L, I mean, Alsophila Loelia or something. I feel as though you've given me your place in the atlases. Henry, I don't think I could have ever discovered it without you. You gave me confidence. You remember, you said that if being with you was going to give me confidence, I was going to be a very confident botanist. Well, you were right. Alsophila Grahammy. Well, well, well.